Okay, so we're starting off this video today. It's probably going to be a really short video, probably only a couple minutes. But I'm just going to go over um, all the different lights I have in the truck and what they do and what I use them for. And um, the first light setup I have is um, the interior glow for the inside lights. Uh, they just light up pretty much where you put your feet when you're sitting down. Um, comes with a cool little remote. You can change all the colors. Uh, they have fading ones. Flashing. So, has a couple different modes. Has music modes. So when there's music, it'll change to the music, stuff like that. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much what that does. Uh, it doesn't really function as anything. I just kind of use it for, just because it looks cool. Pretty simple to install. I actually have an install video I just did. My other video on the channel, you, you can see uh, how those were put on. The next lights that I want to go over are they're actually on the door. So when you open the door, it projects it onto the floor. I mean, I don't know. I think that's pretty cool. Looks pretty sweet. I do have a different set of film. So this can project the Ford logo instead of the flag or whatever else I want to put in there. But those are the only two film things I have right now also have this on the passenger door and again these are ten dollars off amazon and they just look cool they don't really function as a as a light that i would need when i'm off-roading or working on the car or anything like that so the other lights i have are rock lights they go all the way around I have eight pods in total turn off that light so you go to this little remote app I guess connects through Bluetooth and you can the white I like the white a lot so this actually has a function when you're off-roading and let's say you're going I don't know let's say you're doing a little bit of crawling and your wheels are coming up people use these as um, they use them as spotlights to see when your wheels touch which wheels are touching which wheels are not also even if you're out there it, it's good for just being visible you know, so when you're going through the desert, people can see you. If you're stopping on the side of the road, people can see you because it's dark. Uh, it's also fun to just mess around with some of the settings. Like a little police setting here. Then you got the typical just fade through all the colors. And you can adjust everything on the phone. So if you want it slow, It'll fade slow. If you want it fast, it'll flash and blind everyone. Also, that's the speed of which they cycle through. This is the brightness, so you can make it not bright at all. Tiny bit bright. Tiny bit brighter. I usually keep it at full brightness just because it looks sick. But also, the bottom one is if they flash or not. So see, the color's flashing. Uh, highly illegal to drive with, but you can drive with... Uh, green, yellow, purple, orange, um, any colors that aren't red, red, white, or blue. And so I have those all the way around. Have it in the grill as well. I think it looks pretty nice. Has a good range of light. Comes around, looks, it gives a good, good look to the car. So I'll leave that on white for now. So these lights do have a function which is pretty cool. Then come back in here. So I do have a light bar, as you guys can probably see. I have pods on this side, 55 inch bar to another pod, custom built light bar mounts that me and my friend Jared made. Super sick. Uh, Jared is also making flag mounts and, and fire extinguisher holders that are their quick release fire extinguisher mounts 
pretty cool. Go check that out on Instagram. Buys fabrication, super sick. Um, this is the light bar switch itself, and it just keeps falling down. Like it doesn't stay there. I have some 3M tape on it right now, but that's not staying. So what I'm gonna do is I have some just tiny little strips of tape. So I'm gonna put those in, and hopefully that'll keep it from moving around. Okay, so I managed to pull this out a tiny bit so that I can mount it right here, flip it on, flip it off whenever I want, just like that. So I'm going to go ahead and tear the old tape off, put some of the new tape on. Okay, so I have the switch right here, and uh, hang on. So here's the switch. Flip the switch on, got the lights. Got the light bar, has a pretty nice, uh, with the pods on the sides, gets to the sides pretty well. I could adjust it a tiny bit, but um, yeah, I mean, pretty much does what it's supposed to. I mean, it works pretty good for me. And go ahead and turn it off and yeah you guys already know what a light bar is made for I mean obviously the light bars for the desert and stuff like that you know but um all right so that's gonna do it for this one um hey hey blow up blow. I don't even understand how my blow talk Space cool, I don't let my blood walk. Blue freak had to come out of the little bitch.